hello um today is the day that i add more prints to my etsy account um i've been planning on doing that for a while and so many people have asked me to add them because all i'm i've only been selling my prints at um, in-person events and i'm setting my foot down and i'm doing it um my room's a mess but i am currently taking photos using my canvas as like a white background for my prints and i'm like making tiktoks and videos to help promote these things i don't know what i'm doing um but yeah i'm gonna go ahead and start doing that my room is currently a mess as i try to update my shop what did i just step on this is my life um <laughs> just a canvas on the floor and i am making tiktok reels and stuff but this is Yinana silkscreen print that I made and it's supposed to match with another um the the blast silkscreen print that I made. Let me go get both. Yeah, here they are next to each other and I made this one first and it was for my silkscreen class and we had to come up with like a gate poster and I was like oh I don't really know what to do but then I was like oh I should do Nana and yeah, I kind of wanted to just do like, kind of just contrasting, not just like contrasting, but just a completely different color palette than this one. Um, and yeah, making more use of like greens and like, um, I don't know, more of like the pinky tones, I guess, yeah. But yeah. Another silk screen print that I made, um, it's just kind of based on like clowns. And this actually was supposed to be, a tattoo design because i've been kind of dabbling with like making tattoo designs but this i was like i kind of want to make it to a silk screen print and at the end of the semester i was trying to make use of the studio before i graduated so i came up with this and it just says fun on it i don't really know why i just was like yeah it's kind of funny kind of silly goofy but yeah, I really liked how it turned out. I love primary colors and I was like really glad that I was able to kind of turn it into something more. I don't know if the original dye can still be used as a um, tattoo design because it's, this is super complex. And I don't know, we'll see, maybe I can simplify it a little bit, but yeah, this was this one. If I'm being really honest, I'm kind of going into this video kind of with no plan, so I guess I'm showing off my silkscreen stuff. But this was another silkscreen print that I made. I cannot make paper. Um, but I used gold metallic ink, ink on it, and I suffered so much making this print because it, it was just mostly my own, um, my incompetence. I kind of mixed up a lot of the screens together and it was like a whole thing. And then I had to wait for the person prior to finish using the um, particular screen that could um, use the gold ink on it. But I'm really proud of how it came out, honestly. I think if I were to do this again, I probably would add more like background stuff because it is like kind of plain, but I don't know, I, I like how it turned out though. Another silk screen print that I did, and I was kind of going for a continuation of this bug series that I was doing. And in the next print, I'll like kind of show another one because I actually ended up selling out of their first silk screen bug print that I made. I'll probably put like a little image of an example, like somewhere in this little area. But I was not particularly thrilled with this design. Maybe it was just like the green color or something or just, I don't, not the green, not the color. I don't know. I just wasn't, I wasn't even going to print this. I wasn't going to do it. But then I was like, you know what? I did it. It's already, this design is made. Might as well just do it. But, um, yep, that's this the snail and they're going fishing. Super epic. Okay, just kidding. I actually found the first bug print that I made and I was super proud of this one, particularly because I made it in like an hour or so and I was just like, I don't really know what I'm doing. And then it just, the idea came out and I was having a good time, but 
yeah super i love the colors i just love everything about it and i was like wow i can really make this into like a little story or series and this is what kind of started off my like bug series so this is my favorite bug print that i did in the series i again struggled a lot with this because when i was burning the images onto the screen i printed out different sizes so it was like a whole whole ordeal trying to fix everything and so when you when you're using silk screen you have when you burn it into the screen you have to wait like a day for it to kind of settle and so whenever i would try to print i realized i had burned the wrong size images so it was a whole mess but i'm really glad about how it turned out and i love it a lot i i honestly might make this i might put this onto a shirt or something i don't know like i i really love it a lot and i am really obsessed with the the theme of like of a prince and stuff like that uh, i think those are all the silk screen prints that i made so i'm probably just gonna start filming for tiktok again i don't really know what i'm doing and the reels and i'm still trying to figure out i i just do the basic transition of like here i am silk screening um a print and then it just like cuts to the actual print yeah um the algorithms are so interesting because some of them do pretty well and then some don't so let's see how these turn out for these i'm just making the preview picture for the listing on etsy i saw someone online do this thing where it was like it looked like a bunch of stickers like underneath the main sticker that's being sold and i was like that's super cute so this is me just like figuring that stuff out and then this is one of the sonic linear new year illustration prints that's gonna be on my etsy as well all right my etsy shop is live and on my shop, I have original painting prints, silk screen prints, a digital illustration, and then just like a bit of like stickers. And before the video ends, I want to show my Valentine's Day zine that I made for my partner. Around the time I was like updating my shop was Valentine's Day, so that's why I made this. And we both really like cats, so I made it cat themed with cat puns. And I decorated with like a bunch of stickers. And I even like rounded the edges, it was so exciting. I thought it was so cute. But yeah, this is that. And thank you so much for watching my video. I hope everyone has a great day and I'll see y'all soon.